Hello everyone, guess what I did today? I went to the Museum of Contemporary Art Cleveland. This is the gorgeous museum. While there I learned about an incredible artist by the name of Li Ming Wei. Is this your tell first time at the museum? It is my first time at the museum. Can you tell me about this exhibit? Sure. This is an exhibit by an artist who resides in New York. His name is Li Ming Wei. He's originally from Taiwan. And during 9-11, he had a very significant loss. And in order to deal with his grief, he went on and he started fixing his clothes just to sort of occupy himself. Wow. And um, he, you know, sewed buttons, he fixed pockets, he did things. You know, we all have a pile of stuff at home that needs attention. Yeah. We'll never get to it, right? So, friends of his came over to spend time with him, and he started talking to him about what he And that gave him, I believe, an idea for the show. And, um, There is a group of volunteers who staff the marriage and are just one of many things. People who come to visit the museum bring a garment or an item with them that needs to be repaired in some way. And you have a suit while the mender repairs it. But you have to understand from the beginning that it's not going to be a traditional repair. Right, so they're not going to mend it to make it look like You're not going to hem your pants while you wait. Oh, mm -hmm. darn. <laughs> <laughs> so then when we're finished mending and finished our conversation, you have three choices. You can take your garment home with you. You can leave it here for the duration of the show. And we put the information on a tag. And we also duplicate the information in the journal so if the tag gets lost, then we can match it up, you know, to you. Okay. So that you can get it back at the end of the show. Wow. Or you can donate it to the show. Now the items that are folded up here on the table have been donated, and they are attached to the walls by the spools of thread that are up there. And the hope is that all the spools of thread will eventually be attached to garments. Yeah. And, um, that's how the project works. I'm the same artist that built this garden in IQ, and it is his hope that people who come to the exhibition will take a photo, and when you leave, you will give it to someone you don't know. Oh, okay. And so all I do is we are not a stranger. Okay. So we become known to each other, and then you can offer a flower to somebody. Oh, well, that's so nice. So, like, yeah, because it's a very um, close thing to bring your mending to someone that you don't know. Yeah, this is amazing. I love the idea. I'm sad I didn't bring something to have mended. No, I probably can't come back, unfortunately. I think we'll use this video to think about how we can be inspired by this art. Maybe my students and I could create something similar that would have some sort of community interaction. I love I've it. had um, children come, you know, with their parents. Like last Saturday, they had family fun day. You know? uh -huh. So there were a lot of children, and I had a couple of kids bring toys that mm -hmm. you know needed. Oh, that's fun! So, I love that. It reminds me of I was a Peace Corps volunteer and an art teacher at a desk school, mm -hmm. and they would get little rips in their clothes. And I had it was a hand crank, so I, so I set up in a room, and they would, there'd be a line of kids that would bring me their um, torn yeah. uniforms and be gesturing, <laughs> and I'd sew it in the next one. So it reminds me of doing that. Yeah. You've got the experience. You could volunteer as a vendor here. I could. <laughs> if I, was, uh, I was close that. Well, thank you so much for telling us about this. And one other thing, uh, that's that's right. on our YouTube, there's a short video, seven minutes is okay. all it is, but it's by the artist, okay. and he explains what you know inspired this and how it works. Oh, I will definitely find that. You have, it's a wonderful video. Do you know the name of it? It's just, all you have to do is put in the Look mending project. A mending project, okay. Yeah, the mending project. 
I will definitely do that. And you can grab one of the, when you're downstairs uh, near the exit, you know, the, at the desk, they have little pamphlets about the different shows. Okay. So just grab the pamphlet for the show and you'll have the, the name and the artist and everything so you can reference that when okay. you go on YouTube. I love it. Thank you for telling us sure. about this. My and pleasure. hey, Steve, can you take our picture together? Mm -hmm. and then I'll do a still. My students will love this. I think Good. it's really inspiring, and I think it's awesome that you volunteer doing this. How many volunteers are there? Oh, there's a lot. I never count. Okay. <laughs> a lot. Yeah, there are. A lot. Well, there's a lot of shifts. Most shifts are two hours. Okay. But some shifts are just one hour. Okay. And they don't have them all filled. So um, I'm going to pick up some more. Okay. You know, I'm already down for like 20 some hours, but I'm going to do, do more. So. I love that. Inspirational. <laughs> Could you know there's still? Okay. 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 All right. Thank you Enjoy so yourself. much. <laughs> You too. This is so fun. <laughs> we do an art show at a retirement community. And so we're doing 